Look how amazing this barn is. I still have to paint it. Good morning, guys. I could not wait to show you guys this morning what Gabby worked on all not. last night. Gabby couldn't wait either. So uh, yesterday, you guys saw she got a new schleich. Introduce this to your new schleich. Um, Buttercup. Buttercup. This is Buttercup. I'm still thinking of names for her. Oh, so it's not Buttercup? Well, for now it is. For now, she's Buttercup. And you love her? What kind of breed is she? I don't know. And I stopped making her oh, model, man. so... Yeah. Love her. She looks good in like any kind of tack and any kind of position. So you think she's a Han Hanoverian? Yeah. I don't know. Okay. After Gabby bought that horse, she came home and got straight to work. And this is what she created. Show us what it can do. So she's going to paint so, this. Yes. So it looks like it's a, ta a, st a stall. So let's go right here first. Right here is our little red hook with her halter. See how it's like a little halter hook? Beautiful. Show and us. And then I have two bars and like paper clips that I did. This one does not move like this is stationary and then the other one slides slides back and forth isn't that amazing and she has to amazing and she left a spot here for the horse to put its head out yeah. right it can't yeah put it's too it's big head out but so inside you're but making yeah a, if it a, wanted to it can that's what we're is that a water or a food bucket a food bucket this is a feed bucket don't call it a food bucket. It's a feed bucket. Oh my gosh. I will not call it a food bucket. I don't know what I was thinking. Good morning. Oh, oh, oh. And, um, most people make it so that the horses can't walk out with their riders, but, um, like when they get out. But I actually measured so that both the horse and the rider can That's go out. That's cool. Stop, like, instead of doing. That's cool. You guys want a video? Do you want her to make a video on her channel showing you guys how she did that? Comment below if you definitely want it or thumbs up, whatever works best for you. We are headed out today. Where are we headed? Uh, Brooklyn and Jacob. Brooklyn and Jacob. We are going to my son and daughter-in-law's house and visit them and see their brand new house. Uh, for any of you guys who are new subscribers, my oldest son has lived 400 miles away for the whole entire time he's had children. So for four years, um, well actually for longer than four years, but his little babies, his little kids, Brooklyn and Jacob have never grown up around family. They've never had any support of family because they've lived so far away, but now they've been transferred through their job and he's home and they live not that, well they live uh, still a little ways for us, but an easy drive away from us. So we are going to see their house today and I'm super excited. And then we're gonna go and tour a farm today. So the farm that we're going to look at today, I don't know that much about it. Sam never tells me too much or else I just don't hear him. Anyways, um, I don't know too much about it. I just know that it is uh, our smaller acreage, but it's already set up as a horse farm. And our goal when we buy a farm, the reason we're being so picky is that we have the opportunity to be debt free when we buy a house. So we wanna keep the price of our farm that we buy in a certain range so that we can be debt free. That's, that's our goal. So it makes it a little bit harder because we have um, a certain price range in mind and we're kinda of still a little bit picky. We need to get the best farm that we can for the money that we are going to spend. Hi guys. Hi, we are at, whose house are we at? My house. Brooklyn's house. This is her brand new house. Is this your brand new house? Yeah, and what's happening in your room? We're in her room. What are we doing in your room? What's no-no building for you? House. We brought them, we brought her the dollhouse that we promised oh. to give her. The Barbie house, and no-no is setting it up. Should we put this thing on? Okay. It's okay. And then we have Grumpy Gus over there playing with the Barbie car. Jacob, you got the Barbie car? You got Brooklyn's barbecue car? Barbecue, okay. Barbie car? Isn't he the cutest? Okay. And there he goes. Brooklyn, your brother stole your Barbie car. That's okay. Aww, isn't she the cutest? Yummy, 
Come say bye to Nana. Hey, Nana. I love you. Bye. Oh, I can't wait. I'm gonna see you. Oh, just wait. I'm not done. I'm gonna say. Whoops. I'm gonna see you really soon when you come to sleep at Nana's house, right? You're gonna come again and sleep at Nana's house. Yeah. All right. Wait, she is. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. But Brooklyn wants to sleep in my room or Gabby's house. Yeah. Why so have I have an extra bed under the... I'm sleeping in her room. All right, guys, we were at my son's house. He did not want us to show his house because it's not unpacked yet. So uh, we just vlogged a little while we were there, but I vlogged with Brooklyn and Jacob, and I'm so glad because they are the cutest things, and I want to always be able to remember them when they were this little. They're coming in a couple of weeks um, to sleep at our house, so that's going to be awesome. Anyway, we're headed to an open, to not an open house. We're headed to view a house, a farm. It's already set up a farm as a farm. I'm super excited about it, but we're stopping for donuts because we have like half an hour until we have to be there. I got this new purse at a yard sale yesterday. It was so cheap and I love it. Do you like my new purse? Like 50 cents? Three bucks. Don't they don't have the kind of cookie you want. I want have oatmeal raisins. Mm, I love oatmeal raisins. Don't put your feet on there. What do you get, Miss Sophie? Miss Princess Sophie? Ten pack of Timbits. That's what she Ten pack gets. of Timbits. That's what she always gets. Oh, a double chocolate glaze. This is my new favorite summer treat. Isn't that amazing? Super yummy. Lots of whipped cream and chocolate sauce. There's no caffeine in it. Mm, it's my favorite thing. What'd you get? Coffee? My new favorite thing, coffee. It's his old favorite thing too. And I got a uh, double you chocolate. You got a chop double chocolate? What'd you get? So, Gabby? What? What'd you get? Chocolate chunk cookie. She got a chocolate chunk cookie. All right, so we're here at the house. And this barn over here that's fallen down is not included. It's just this section here. And so it's a sentry house, it looks like. Out to the end, it kind of goes like this. So the other side here, the flat part, and then the bathroom's huge. Well, that's a neat spot for towels. Oh, okay. To a bedroom. You'd have to share a room. Mom, this is small, so it'd be nice. No. You'd probably have to share it. It's super cute. Cool yeah, but it's nice outside that's Yeah, well, that one's just the other room. It's actually cute. <coughs> well, it's not that big. We have a wall. <coughs> yeah, oh, a window in the... You see the horses? Oh. I see one in the round pen. Oh, a white one. We could probably go out there and see. Sure. You have to be careful. No, no, don't me. She bit me. The big okay. black one. It's just playing. Oh look, there's horses there. Don't touch any fences. No. Oh look at he's a pretty horse. I think I have a thing for horses with a white face. Oh, Isn't I he pretty? This face is called Bald. 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 I like that. Oh, he's pretty. He's a pony. I have to cut all that out. Look how pretty he is. Hello. Ooh, don't eat that. That's prickly. There's five stalls. There are five. And that's the tack room right there. Oh, he really likes you guys, huh? Fine. He can hear pretty good. He no. Aww. Lots of flies. Yeah. He's cute though. He probably doesn't even bother him. So that bar was a little rough to me. It was big enough for us. The girls would have to share a bedroom. It needed a lot of work. The barn was okay. The property was nice. It was big enough and I liked the layout of the property. 
but there was a lot of weeds and stuff that needed to be chopped down, which is not that big a deal. Sam could do that. So let's do. Would you buy that? Thumbs up or down? I wouldn't buy it. Gabby's a thumbs down. You're a thumbs down. What are you? I'm in the middle. And I, uh, I just want to farm. I'm like at the point where I'm like, just pick something and we'll just buy it. But I don't think that farm's the right one for us. We are home from the house that we went to look at and from our visit with our with Mark and Stacy, And we've got a new vacuum, guys. I cannot hardly wait to show you our new vacuum. It's the, the Econo model. Small. He's like, I'll get that. Watch him. No. He's like, hmm. This is his daily visit out of his crate. I've been cleaning his cage. A new vacuum! <laughs> a new vacuum! Oh, let me take it from the vacuum. Well, then he drops it. I'll eat it. Oh, look, here he comes. He's like, I'll just bring it over here. <laughs> I'll take oh, I just love him. He's like, hmm. I'm gonna hide this from that big old dog over there. He's like, there needs to be two in each pile. He puts the white ones over here and the yellow ones over there. <laughs> You're gonna be your man's laughing. Here he comes. Here he comes. He sees the whole bowl. He's like, oh, I want to eat it all. That's why you gotta move it. He's like, hmm. He's not very afraid, is he? It's like, mm -hmm. it's a huge white egg. Yeah. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> Things are getting crazy. He's protecting his food from the dogs. He's, watch him. He'll chase her down. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh, Bailey, somebody's stealing your food. Abby. Quick! Abby. Somebody's got your food! Somebody's behind you stealing your food! <laughs> Bailey! You're not very See, how can we release a bird that dumb? And he's like, oh my goodness! You took my food! Why is everybody laughing at me? He says. <laughs> Now he's going back to see where his food is. He's like, hey, <laughs> he's finally cluing in. That big white bird took my food. <laughs> we want to thank you guys for so many comments on today's vlog. I know a lot of you guys are concerned and think <coughs> that the girls are not ready for a board. The board that we're actually looking at is a quarter board. I've never even heard of that before. And basically it's just a few extra riding lessons each week. Anyway, Anytime we take their kids for a board, it's not like we're just gonna drop them at a barn and let them ride horses. The, the board that we're gonna get for them is gonna be supervised, it's gonna have instructors, and yeah, so don't worry. We are not gonna do anything to jeopardize ourselves or anybody's horse, right? Right, anyway, the lady has not texted me or called me back yet, and I remember from a long time ago when we were at that barn, um, that she's not very good at com or contacting people back. So I'm going to call her again tomorrow and we're going to try and get out there and see what they have to offer us and we'll vlog all about it and you guys can see for yourself what we're up against. Anyway, I am going to end the day with comment of the day. And it is from My Mini Zoo 101. So My Mini Zoo 101 has to say, I love you guys so much. You guys are so amazing and Gabby and Sophia are really good at riding. You make me smile every day and I think it would be awesome for the girls to part board. Right now I'm 10 years old and I'm part boarding an Appaloosa horse named Ivan who is 15.1 hands. I also have two dogs, two rats, three snakes, one fish, one chinchilla and one hamster. And you thought you had a lot of pets. <laughs> no birds though. Did she have a bird? No. Um, part boarding is awesome because you get a real feel of having your own horse. You go there, get your horse, groom, tack up, and ride all by yourself. I think you should really do that. I love you guys and it's my dream to get a shout out. Well, my mini zoo 101, that is your shout out, right? How do you feel? Comment of the day is even that's better your, than Yeah, that's your comment. That's our comment of the day. What do you think when people say nice things like that about you? Love. I don't know. Love it. And that was a Beatles. Yeah. What do you feel? How do you feel when people say mean things to about you? I hate them. No, we don't hate <laughs> yeah, them. Yeah, I hate them. Everybody has a different opinion. Everybody is coming from a different place and a different experience, and everybody has a different opinion. And I like hearing everybody's point of view because it makes me think. Attacking. It brings other um, things 
to the table that I didn't even know to think about and I like hearing everybody's opinion even the ones that have an opinion against what our opinion is there's nothing wrong with that <coughs> fight her fight her fight her fight her oh my god her, he's actually her, pecking the dog fight between between a golden doodle and a baby crow here it goes Stop moving. <laughs> That's a boring dog, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Saying, so, yeah, I'm winning. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, click the i card above in the top right corner which is this one <laughs> so you can see other videos see you later bye and don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below